Finns here with Cadence's version 17.2 2016 release. Pat Stack creation is now easier than ever before thanks to the redesigned Pat Stack editor interface. Whether editing an existing Pat Stack or defining a new one, the intended use of the Pat Stack can now be assigned as an internal attribute, as seen in the summary tab, which can be recognized by downstream partners. One such example is a pad stack predefined as fiducial, being recognized during the assembly process. In addition to the standard circular drill, square drill is a new option. And to assist with pad stacks used for press fit connectors, besides the finished hole diameter, users can also specify the actual drill tool size. Back drilling, counter bore, and countersink can now be defined from the secondary drill tab and once selected, drill operation parameters become available. All of these parameters are passed to drill legends and exported through vehicles such as IPC 2581. New primitives, also recognized by IPC 2581, are available to reduce the reliance on custom patch shapes. Various geometries from these primitives can also be derived, such as a tombstone or home plate pad definition. Donut type pads can easily be created simply by specifying inner and outer diameters which can be very advantageous when creating unplated money holes with plated vias spread around the donut. Multiple shapes can now be defined for complex mask pad flashes such as a window pane pattern and assigned to a paste mask layer. Layer keepouts can be defined for SMD pins for adjacent plane voids for controlled impedance, or create blind buried via keepouts to alleviate potential drill overshoot. Same layer keepouts can be defined to provide ample clearance around pad stack drills for skip vias or unused pad suppression. At the design level, pad level properties can be added to pins or vias to control thermal conductivity in dynamic shapes bringing more control of the design characteristics to the designer. With all of the new version 17.2 2016 capabilities, creation of pad stacks is now easier than ever before and gives more power to the designer to specify, visualize, and realize design intent. Pad stacks in ORCAD. It's that easy.